Hello everybody, welcome back to another edition of Matchbox Marks Diecast Restorations. So, uh, no, I'm not doing another school bus build. Uh, if you saw my other video, I did, gosh, I think I did about 29 school buses I handed out to some staff at my school. Just an appreciation gift for all that they do, and it was a Christmas present to a lot of my teachers in my department. So, I'm pretty familiar with taking these old school buses apart. So, uh, in continuing with my theme builds, as you can see, uh, this is not a Charger or Roadrunner. Uh, those have been my usual theme builds. But this project I cannot do with a Charger or Roadrunner. I have to do with a school bus. And that leads me into uh, the theme. Well, uh, if you have been around for a while and you're my age or older, I'm 53, so uh, there was a show on TV in the 70s called The Partridge Family. And it was a family that uh, used to go around and sing in their school bus that was customized. And uh, if you, uh, you want to look at that school bus, uh, go on Google Images. Um, I don't have a picture of it, but anyway, I will have a picture of it when I paint this. So it is going to be extremely difficult and uh, probably take me a lot of time because the paint job on there is very unique. So anyway, it was a really good show. So, uh, all right. So stay tuned um, as I take this apart for the, well... I guess 30th time. All right, so let's take this bus apart. I forgot to mention it is a Matchbox 1985. Let me see here. Should be, yep, 1985. All right, before we uh, roll the old bus on the uh, stage, let's take a look at this Partridge Family bus. Now, uh, the base coat's going to be white, and obviously there's no rhyme or reason to the paint patterns. Well, obviously there is. Uh, but I don't know if I can mirror this, mirror this exactly, but I'm going to try. So, uh, basically, uh, this is not the right type of bus. This is, I believe, an old GMC. And as you can see, the painting is going to be uh, labor intensive. However, I'm up for the challenge. And actually, I went on Google Images, and of course, they always bring eBay stuff on there. And you can buy the 164th uh, Partridge Family bus on eBay, but it's not quite identical. And what fun would that be? Anyway, here we go. Here's our old school bus. Let's take it apart. Okay. Drilled out two rivets. As always, here we go, and everything just falls right out. All right, so obviously, going to keep the interior the way it is. I might paint it brown. Uh, it's hard to really get the in color of the interior in the picture. But anyway, here's the, uh, that just comes out like that. Here's the base. No surprises there. Tires, great shape. And the front. So, uh, there they are. Uh, I wonder if I can come up with a, uh, a good looking model. Well, we'll find out. So, uh, stay tuned. And I'm going to take this to the stripper and, uh, and go from there. Stay tuned. All right, here's the Partridge Family bus getting ready for primer. And uh, all the paint came off this model pretty easy, too. Just kind of had to scrape it away with the toothbrush. All right, stay tuned. All right, so here's a picture of the uh, Partridge Family bus all primed up. It's going to put a coat of white paint on it. So stay tuned. All right, got the bus all painted up, which is the easy part. 
And now I have to turn that into this. So I think it's going to be pretty difficult. So, all right. Well, stay tuned. I'm going to see what I can come up with. All right, so let's uh, take a look at the school bus before the customization via Partridge family style. So just a plain old yellow school bus. And let's see what we ended up with. All right, it is time for the reveal for the Partridge family bus. So this was really fun. A, to relive the memories of watching the Partridge family on TV in the 70s. And uh, when I first started this, I was going to paint every single square on here. I'm thinking to myself, well, it's got to be an easy way. So I went on Google Images and I Googled uh, Partridge family paint pattern and just put some images onto a work document and put it on a water slide paper and... And that's how I got them. And then, of course, I, I painted in the rest of the details, like in the window frames are different colors. The tire rims are different colors. And uh, so, yeah, it's not perfect. Uh, it's not exact, but it's pretty close. So uh, I want to thank you for watching this build. It was definitely entertaining. Um, if you like this video, hit the like button, subscribe, and all that good jazz, and stay safe, and I appreciate you watching. And I'll see you on the next one.